Alrighty guys, so uh, I tried to put another set of cables on the uh, Crown Victoria and uh, to jump it off, time and chain is gone in it. It wouldn't even hit a lick. We tried pouring uh, fuel down the intake and it would kind of pop and crack, but you could hear the, the chains rattle real bad and they were squeaking. So I, I pulled over here now and I've got the positive terminal is missing, so I've got a vice grip on it holding the wires to it we put the cables on it so we're gonna try this uh, Lincoln hey guys what kind of breakfast do you get at a cheap motel do you get it <laughs> a knee slapper so funny Ooh, we got lights and I hear a fuel pump and here we go Let me wiggle some cables. Not unless the starter's been robbed. Usually doesn't take much wood jiggling. Be respectful of the Continental kids. I always clean the mud off your boots. Alright, take two. Oh. Oh my god, it runs. Let's move my seat up off the ground. Don't rev a cold motor, they say. Well, this car is scrap, so...
good sound and engine. That hollow noise that kind of resembles a rod knock is where the exhaust is cut off. It's probably pointed at something underneath the car. The engine itself isn't knocking. It'd make a good field car at least. So, 1997 Lincoln Continental. I think that's what the title said. Yeah, 97 Lincoln Continental. Junkyard fine. Will it run? Hell yes, it will. If I had tires on it, it'd probably drive. Maybe in a later day or something, I can round us up some tires and a battery terminal to stick on it so we can take it for a romp around the yard. Now, if I shut it off, you think it'll crank back up? Oh yeah. That is too cool. Will it run? For sure it will. Alrighty guys. Thanks so much for watching. Drop a comment down below. Let us know what you think. Lincoln Continental. With that big 32 valve. It's like the Cobra motor almost. Mm-mm-mm. North Stars blow head gaskets. Continentals usually eat transmissions, but this one seemed like it was still good. All right, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.